when celebrities meet their crush. Hello guys, today we are back with another interesting video. We all have our fair share of celebrity crushes whom we long to meet. But what happens when celebrities themselves meet their celebrity crushes? Now that's some fascinating content right there. Let's take a look at some of our favorite celebrities meeting their celebrity crushes. Selena Gomez meets Shia LaBeouf. In many interviews, Selena has mentioned her very obvious crush on the Transformers star, Shia LaBeouf, and the day finally came when she got to meet him. The meet was a surprise planned by her friends. Okay. Hello. Oh my gosh. <laughs> hey. When Gomez saw him sitting inside the room, she got shocked and backed away. Later, he came up to her and hugged her as they exchanged some sweet words. Hey! Hey, nice to meet you. Hi. Hi, how are you? How you doing? I'm so sorry to bother you. Thanks for being so sweet. Selena's reaction is quite priceless. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You I need to get a picture yeah, of yes. you guys cool. together. Cool. Yeah. You take a picture of you. Yes. All right. Charlie Puth meets Jennifer Aniston. We are all big fans of Friends and loved Jennifer Aniston who played the role of Rachel in the show. Well, we are not the only ones. Charlie Puth has mentioned his undying love for the show Friends and his favorite Jennifer Aniston on The Ellen Show. You are, uh, Jen Aniston is here. You're a huge Friends fan, right? I am, yeah. yeah. I, I'm, uh, I'm shaking from excitement. Really? Yeah, I'm, I really hope there's a reunion. This resulted in Ellen surprising him by calling Jennifer on the show. Charlie's panic can be seen as he says, I'm dying right now. A cute sight for all of us. Jen, Jen, come back out here. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. I mean, oh. Hi. Oh. Hi. Hi. Yeah. I'm dying right now. Are you Nick Jonas meets Amelia Clark. Nick Jonas is absolutely fascinated by the Game of Thrones actress, Amelia Clark. Honestly, this is something we can all relate with since Clark is quite irresistible. On BBC Radio 1's breakfast show, they finally got the chance to meet for the second time after the Oscars. On the radio show, Nick very awkwardly confesses that he is not only obsessed with the show, but also Amelia's Instagram. While none of us can withstand Amelia Clark's charm, not even Nick. He's there. He's closer Hi. than you think. Oh, hello. <laughs> Amelia Clark, Nick Jonas, Nick Hi. Jonas, Amelia Clark. Hi, I'm good. How are you? You, you really set me up for failure to not look mean? cool at all. Why? <laughs> One of your biggest fans is in the building. <laughs> you, can be, you can be a fan. I can, no, I'm a huge fan. I'm not, I actually have already met Amelia and, and I said just that. Where did you meet? The, uh, Noah Schnapp meets Zendaya. Stranger Things star Noah Schnapp's huge crush on Zendaya is not a secret. He is completely smitten with the girl like many of us. In the Midnight Show with Jimmy Fallon, Schnapp shared his experience of meeting Zendaya in detail. His reactions and fanboying instances are an adorable sight. This was so sweet, it makes you question me and who right away. You got to meet Zendaya. Yes, I did. And that's a big... What, that was... Pin for Zendaya. Oh, I love Zendaya. Me and Zendaya were... Zendaya was in my... Hello? Hi, Zendaya. Okay. I don't even know how to put into work. Taylor Swift meets Justin Timberlake. Throwback to when Ellen DeGeneres surprised Taylor Swift by bringing her longtime crush Justin Timberlake on The Ellen Show. Taylor couldn't contain her excitement on seeing him and Justin's flustered expression is totally obvious. We can all agree that Ellen has the best surprises. Yeah. Well, I said I'd bring him next time you're here. Justin! <laughs> Billie Eilish meets Justin Bieber. Billie Eilish's obsession with Justin Bieber is something we can all relate to. It was seen at Coachella 2019. Justin Bieber himself surprised her when they met for the first time. Their hug is a heartwarming moment shared between them. Though, this was not the end of their interaction. 
The pair is later seen in carpool karaoke, having fun together. Billy's smile around Justin Bieber is the cutest thing ever. Here we are. We're back, baby. <laughs> Duh. All seven. Uh-huh. Uh, we lay Standing all... there, and we were just watching the set, and I was rocking out because I love Ariana. I was like, you know what? You're not the one less lonely girl. You're the one last lonely girl. You know, I'm sorry. Can I did it that way? On the ukulele with my friend. I think I was seven. Uh-huh. Uh, we lay all day in our comfy bed. What a wonderful life. We, we play outside in the green grass. What a wonderful life. What a wonderful life. Chance the Rapper meets Beyonce. The epic MTV VMAs interview crash is reasonably unforgettable. Beyonce surprises Chance the Rapper mid-interview, and his reaction is the cutest thing ever. No wonder I too would be shaken if Beyonce walked past me like that. Drake, I'm also coming for your muscles. So, videos and muscles, I'm on your ass. Drake! Oh my god, that was awesome! <gasps> that happened. Kiki Palmer meets Michael Ealy. American actress Kiki Palmer, getting surprised by her celebrity crush Michael Ealy on the first episode of her show, Just Kiki, is the most iconic thing ever. Stunned, Kiki flings herself on the couch on seeing Ealy with flowers in his hands. This is an accurate representation of how we feel internally on seeing our crush. Oh my god! BB oh Rexa meets Grace Vanderhall. Enough about all these one sided crushes and unrequited love. BB Rexa and Grace Vanderhall's crush is mutual and too beautiful. They are seen hugging and fangirling over each other at the Teen Choice Awards. That looks like the start of a wholesome friendship. Emma Stone meets Mel B. This is one of the most touching moments ever seen. Emma Stone tears up while talking to her celebrity crush slash idol, Mel B. Emma's surprise is evident as she asks, Oh my god, is Mel B talking to me? This interaction was so genuine, it even makes me cry. Hi sure. Emma, this is Mel B here. Oh my god, from First the space of all, I want to say I absolutely adore you and I love you. And I want to say thank you for being such a Spice Girl fan. I Who love you. Oh um, my but my question to you is, why did you like Baby Spice and not me more? <laughs> and your punishment for that is that I want you to do a rendition of one of the Spice Girl songs. You what? Anyone. Oh my god. We're yeah. getting the wine yeah. at awesome. and I'm not sure if it's for the interview being... or for your singing. We're uh, <laughs> clear on it. Did you like my singing? I loved no, no, no. it. Oh, Emma, I'm really excited. absolute pleasure. Thank you. For That's it for the day, guys. There's just a limit to cuteness that we can handle in a day. Let's keep some for another day to make you smile after a bad day at the office. Anyways, let us know in the comments section which was your favorite reaction. If you enjoyed the video, then don't forget to like it and subscribe to our channel for more entertaining videos like this. Also, click on the bell icon to get notified every time we post. See you in the next video. Peace.